oxygen. But I was upgrading it too, so, you know, maybe it was alright. Wow, yeah, you get pretty crazy. But, uh... Hmm. That was a that good was, game. That was a surprise end to that game for me. It's <laughs> only <laughs> the map is very empty. But yeah, I don't, like, somebody EMP'd my carbon, which I guess is kind of like a reasonable play in some ways, except it defended my off-world for an entire extra minute while it was already adrenaline boosted. Right. So it just saved me so much money. I got up a super cheap off-world. It cost me like 47000 to build that off-world. Mm -hmm. Something ridiculously cheap like that. And then I got to just dump adrenaline boosts in it. Right. And that was the that was the entire game. Wow. That was pretty fascinating. I shouldn't have built the second off-world, but that's fine. I, I managed to get away with it. Wait, you had a second? Because I have a second off-world, yeah. I have two off-worlds. They're both hologrammed. Um... One of them is next to my electrolysis, and one of them is next to my carbon. Okay. All right, I gotta step up one second, so I'm gonna host the game. Okay, um, sounds good. You, just, you guys can just join. I'll be right back. Okay. All right, guys. Um. <laughs> Well, Game Slayer, I don't know if anybody could have helped stop the off-world. They could have attacked other things about me. Stream is cutting out. Hold on. Let me look into that. Yeah, I guess... Because that's weird and should not be happening. Alright, guys, I'm actually also tempted to step away for a second maybe i'll wait for soren to get back and then he can talk at you guys we can talk about that last game so games i guess it were you the one who threw an emp at me it would have been really hard to attack my off world at that point at least in time to do anything about it Let's see. Hey, well, Yezo, I think a lot of that comes down to the UI update, right? This basic idea of it'll be easier. Although in this particular case, Game Slayer did shout to the entire world and was paying oh. attention to the moment my off-world landed. So, uh, so how did he pick it up? How did he notice it? Oh, I just I just had a like a moment's hesitation between when I put the off-world down and when I actually dropped the hologram. Oh, you and did Yezo the, was talking about the hologram first. Yeah, he, he usually I hologram first, but in this case I didn't because I don't play he perfectly. He just happened to be watching you at that moment? Yeah, apparently. <laughs> this is, Which totally... is why I usually drop the hologram first. And for the second one, I had the hologram down for quite a while before I put the off-world down. Well, I don't remember right. exactly how long it was, but it was at least a few seconds. Yeah, I, game says I saw it when you was leaving your base. So if it's, okay. if it's, if it's hologrammed, when you click... It'll still fly out there. No, 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 or, it won't. Or it won't? Okay. It won't. If it's hologrammed, the off-world will not leave your base. But gotcha. of course, you were not hologrammed, so it did come out of the base. I don't know what happens. Does it disappear halfway through? Or I, I actually don't know. I think the tile just turns invisible after it lands. Like, when, when the hologram gets placed down, right? Oh, are you yeah, talking I, about if the hologram think, gets placed while it's flying? I think, as, yeah, I think while it's flying, I think, ideally, as soon as you place the hologram, the flying unit should vanish. Right. That's what's supposed to happen. I don't know if that Makes is sense. what's happening. That reminds me, I think you can still see repair robots flying to tiles that are hologrammed. Okay. As invisible. Oh. Uh, you mean it's destroyed? Yeah, like the tile gets destroyed, so the hologram goes to invisible. Like you drop a dynamite on it. Oh, I see. And then I think you can see the repair robot. Well, I go out sure. to it, that kind of thing. Not, it, doesn't, it doesn't tell you what type of building it is. So. Fair enough. I'm not. I, I'm kind of okay with there being kind of a few random glitches involving holograms. 
I just want to handle the like the, the main right. the, the the core cases, you know. I actually needed to step away for just a minute, but I didn't want to leave the stream completely empty. So okay, all right. I'll be, well, maybe I'll you can talk yell at people or something, and I'll all be right. back in just one minute. All right. Well, uh, if anyone has any questions, type in the chat. Um, but uh, let me take a look. See if there's anything. Yeah, I agree. I mean, I think that in um, that we do need some communication to help, like, remind people to try to bring down Top Dog. So I'm I'm okay with that too. Um, Sort of like 5.5, 5. um, but yeah, this is uh, this is some of the you know previous some of the changes that are becoming to beta six. Um, so you know, there's some big uh, new uh, features: the majority buyout, the destroyed buyout mode, um, and so that's why I wanted to get this up a little early just so I can get some feedback on people because it's a big change. I didn't want to just sort of drop it on everyone. Um, and uh, as for Fee Huck, uh, for further interaction with the colony, I mean that's. Mostly stuff that I'm doing in the campaign, um, oh, <laughs> and uh, the campaign is not going to have cheesy mission routines. Um, eh, but um, but yeah, I mean the colony does. I, I don't know. I mean you can actually get some benefit by paying attention if like the colony is like really heavy into labs or heavy into. Um, uh, the, you know, uh, workshops or uh, what's the other one? Um, it, because that affects you know whether electronics or chemicals can go up. Um, but I don't know. I mean, I, I don't know if um, I mean it's until the top players are really paying attention to it. I don't think it's really um, really where it needs to be yet. Um, I don't know. Do you ever look at what the colony is composed of in multiplayer games? Yeah. No. Like, literally, literally never. Yeah. No, part of that, I think, is just... It's not necessarily that the colony is unimportant. Mm -hmm. It's just unimportant compared to everything else. But the other people... You know, it's just, and, and based on how much time I have to look around, and me in particular, because I'm one of the worst at this, I'm really bad at looking around. So maybe somebody You're like really Game Slayer or Blues... Yeah, I'm really bad at looking around. It's, it's awful. At least I consider myself really bad at looking around. Right. Look, situational awareness in RTSs has always been right. a huge weakness of mine. I mean, one thing I did is when the, the, the new buildings, I mean, the problem is they all, all, they all look white, so they're kind of hard to differentiate, but when the labs and the workshops get built, they get clustered together. Mm -hmm. So ideally, a quick glance at the colony and you should be able to like... I've see, noticed that, yeah. Just... See what it is. All right, is everybody ready? I think so. All Hopefully right. Terry and Blues are still around. Oops, oops, I think I... Did you forget... Whoa. Yeah, I didn't set any options. And all. you managed to cancel the game starting. Did it actually kick it, kick it out? Yeah, I'm, I'm back at the multiplayer screen wow. here, so... I didn't know that worked. Uh, Alright, we'll do reveal map. And... Oh, look at that notification. I never see these things. Oh, that, that the thing was changed? Yeah, just because I'm always hosting, so... It's nice to see these things. All right, uh, I think I'm good now. We got real map, majority by just for about no masquerade. <laughs> You're gonna have to live with it. No, it's fine. It's fine. Well, in these four-man games, we're honestly, we're kind of to the players. point where they're all good players, and they're not going to try and just kill me for being me. Yeah. Masquerade was more important in those, like April period for me. Yeah, Ooh. when we had plenty, a lot of people still kind of playing, but right, 
and you would get as many as like 80 people watching on one of my streams, and a couple of them were just there to cause problems. So Masquerade would at least help a little bit with that. If not completely fix the situation. Alright, well, this is happening. <laughs> the exact spot I was, I was hovering. Of course it was. Of course it yeah. was. Come on. Uh, uh, what debt did you take it at? Like 48,000. <laughs> Ridiculously high, basically, but maybe, maybe it's acceptable. This is so dumb. I love it in some ways. Like, I'm not, I'm not opposed to it. It's just so dumb. I should really have done this slightly differently. Well, this neighbor is getting crowded. Yeah, not too surprising. Oh wow, really crowded. <laughs> hey everybody, welcome to the northern half of the map. Glad you're here. Not. Oh, auction. How do you feel about the auction uh, black market effect, by the way, since that's in the game right now? Uh, oh! Oh, by the way, this has changed. You can mm -hmm. auction off any tile on the map. Mm but you, okay. you don't, if you auction off a tile you don't own, then it's it's just like, you, you can bid for it just like anyone else. Oh, so you can just, if you want an extra tile, you can yeah. just start an auction for that yeah. tile and then try exactly. and win it. Yes. That's a lot more interesting. And, but you can still auction your own tiles, I You can still I auction off your own tile off. I don't know if we need to turn that off. And no. that's back to having a black market cooldown rather than being yes, that's any, right. any whenever you want. Which thanks, to, thanks to Zoltar. You're welcome, community. Hey, somebody had to be that, get that guy. Somebody always has to be that guy who completely ruins the game for everybody else, right? Yep. Year End will probably never forgive me for that, and I understand that. I love I it when high-level players do I that. That was pretty funny. I mean, I was, I was actually genuinely curious what was going to happen. I almost got to the point. I was actually getting pretty close to being able to execute a buyout with that. Mm -hmm. like yeah, you almost, of, you almost pulled it off, in which case, like... Give up half my territory to get an entirely new colony <laughs> would yeah. have been totally fine. Oh, man. I was kind of hoping to be able to use that water. That's not going to happen. Nope. Yeah, I mean, that's why... I thought I was thinking of finding there too, but yeah, you can realize now that was just a pipe dream. Uh, what else do I claim? What do I want to actually do here? I feel like I should be using the black market, but it's kind of hard to pick a, a thing I really want to do with it right now. Improving efficiency. Beginning okay, that's getting taken. Reticulating splines. Mm, that's tempting, just because it's easy. I don't really like that at all. I was sitting here thinking, man, I need to punish that somehow, and then it was like, oh wait, I literally can't. Punish what? Terry's adrenaline boost. Oh, he's boosting. Yeah, it's like the single most important thing to shut down in a lot of ways, and I'll, some of the time you just literally can't. Man, that iron price is gonna jump up. Oh, you boosted your iron too, I guess. So. Well, I boosted both, yeah. So that helps me a little bit more than it helps him, thankfully. Or my boost is better than his boost is another way to look at it. I should have paid attention to the There was a boost on the market. It's funny, I ignored the last game, so I just kind of forgot about it. Or yeah. two games ago, whenever that was. Remember. Well, goodbye, iron. Oh, silicon's gonna be what saves me. Jeez. The black market is online. That is so tempting and yet so risky. I don't think I'm gonna quite do it. What are you talking about? Oh, just things I'm thinking about. Actually, don't want to quite do that yet, but in the future it might be useful. Let me make my decision what I'm actually going to do before I upgrade. I never took that actual... Although I guess if you're robotic, it actually doesn't matter. Yeah, not as much, no. You can honestly, like as robotic, it's a lot easier to just upgrade and get away with it, obviously, so... Seven. 
gonna let Terry run away with too many bonuses here at this rate. Then at least let make him pay for it. I mean, not that much, because I don't have that much money, but at least a little bit. Come on. Come on, guys. Sell the aluminum. I know you guys all have it. Yeah, but you don't. <laughs> Isn't that the point? Isn't that how the game works? You know. Really? Really? <laughs> Is that what we've got to do right now? Man. Let's see how it is. Oh man, three geos? Oh. Do I get the power? Does Terry have three geos? Yeah, he's building three geos. Oh, right he's now. gonna be up to four soon. Shoot, alright. We'll get your mutinies ready. Sorry, he's gonna be up to five in a moment, so power's five, just gonna die. Five geos? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Oh, interesting move. I haven't seen that too much. Well, he's gonna run away with things with it at this rate. Yeah. Look at how fast yeah. he's paying down debt. Like 800 yeah. a second right now. Five geos. Pirates. I hate That's just insane. Man, and my silicon's getting pirated. I mean, that, stop. We'll Please see stop. what he Please does. Stop. I mean, the thing is, he can't do anything with those tiles. So we just gotta make sure the price stays low. Oh, I know. I'm working on it. I'm very upset that I'm being attacked while I'm trying to fix the Terry situation. No, well, I just As I'm gonna you. name it. You mutiny me and... I I'm getting pirated, well, earlier, oh, yeah, right, and right, now right, I'm getting right. pirated on the silicon, and it's just like... Oh. Come on now. Come on now what? <laughs> it's not bad. Alright. Come on now what? What's going on? Oh, is there an energy surplus? There might have been. Wow. Well, that's that's fortunate. So this is an interesting yeah, spot fortunate now. Fortunate is made a bunch of for money, it. but so what? Fortunate, right? like, fortunate is not the word for that energy surplus, by the way. I'm just gonna let you in on that. For you or for who? For nobody. That was not the fortune did not come into play. Well, the the question is how much money was Terry making off of the, all those geotherms, and the power surplus kills that, right? So. Oh, I know, I know. I'm just saying that maybe maybe the power surplus was intentional. Oh. <laughs> okay. I. That's not what. I, yeah. Okay. Because if he's going to uh, commit five permanent tiles to power, it yeah, only well, makes sense. Yeah, so this is fascinating because now he's stuck with five dead tiles. I don't think he made. I don't think he made enough money off of it to justify it. Man, I hope not. Not with steel being its current price. Pirates. I hate those filthy bandits. I also hate those filthy bandits just because they always are hitting my silicon right now. That's two sets of pirates on my silicon. Silicon's not even all that good. It's, I guess it's okay. New directives received and I haven't even looked at the. Oh, wow. I really should have looked at that. In progress. Stand by. Okay, we can work with this. Jerks taking all my, all my stuff. I need my stuff. Our hackers have compromised the trading. I don't remember what I just did. No. It's just turning into one of those days. I'm gonna try something. Is that a mule? Is that your mule? Yeah, it's my mule. So you took the mule earlier. All right. Fair. That's fair. Oh, that's you. Okay, you're trying yeah. to take a you're trying to take a tile next to yourself. Yeah, basically, like what? How much? How much were they forced? Yeah, how much are people going to make you pay for it? It's a good question. I mean, it's still a tile, right? You could have taken it for sixteen. It's just sixteen thousand debt. You are robotic. Yep. Yeah, so maybe you can get up. away with it. 
I was just mad at him at some point. Oh, I understand. Terry's aggressive. It's okay. I don't, I don't know what you expect out of Terry besides him being aggressive. Okay, I still have five claims sitting around right now. I should really fix that. Expansive colony expanded. I'm actually gonna do. Am I gonna do that? No. Scientific I'm not gonna do that. Expanded. Do that. Rude. I guess it was, was up to pretty expensive, so. It's fair, but rude. That wasn't me. Why has everybody got... No, Terry, so saying... excited about my aluminum? He hasn't even done anything with that tile the auction. Ugh. Of course he hasn't. That wasn't the point. He didn't want it. You're just spiting me? Yeah, of course. You don't. You didn't oh, need it, is what it comes down to, to realistically. Sense. You didn't need didn't that need tile, tile, obviously. So he took it from you. You could have used it, but you didn't need yeah. it. So you're fine. Don't worry about it. I need an engineering lab. That's what I need. Well, scrap your iron. Iron's actually pretty good. That might not be the best idea. I always got to remember, this is something I have trouble with sometimes, especially after some of these adjacency bonuses changed and such, just how much... How many raw resources get pulled in by high tiles is so insane. Right. How's the... You're shorting glass? Our hackers have Everyone has glass. Trading servers. But how much glass? glass uh, Alright. It's also about just when that started and all kinds of other details. Has he turned off selling power, you think? He must have. There's no way power could get to 80 if he was, if he was selling power. Probably. It would have been a good move. A necessary yeah. one, realistically. Pretty much the only move, yeah. Unfortunately, I still think Terry is probably in a great spot, and I don't have a good way to identify what to shut down and where. Because without spies, it's much more difficult to deal with holograms and the like. Yeah. Okay, yeah, Terry has one. There it is. Alright, I spotted Terry's off-world. That's good. Mine apparently also got spotted at some point. Our hackers have There's like a power at some point. Turning it off is a good move. Good on him for uh, figuring it out, I guess. I'm just struggling to keep up right now. That's not going to go well for me. Okay, I need to do that. Why are those back on? That was not what I meant to do with those. Unfortunately, I managed to plant myself outside of the dry ice, and dry ice yeah, is pretty cool right now. Yeah, I was just looking for the exact same thing. Eight, thousand, ten, thousand, twelve, Everything's thousand, so expensive. Fourteen, thousand. Okay, that's fine. Is anyone making carbon at all? I don't wow. know. Maybe not. I was thinking I'd be able to at some point, but that didn't really pan out for me like I was hoping. Come on, work with me here. We're not surprised. Justice. Interesting. So that actually showed up as an off-world for a moment. That's kind of an issue. What happened? Oh, well, he had his off-world hologrammed this whole time. But yeah. I still saw it as an off-world for a moment when it was created. Like, it, it, it legitimately appeared as one. Huh. That's yeah, it's kind of my thought. Interesting, unfortunate, not really what you're looking for in some ways. At least not if you're using the holograms. Okay, come 
one. Oh, I do have dry ice. Ah, come on. I never... I thought I... No, I purchased the wrong thing on accident, I think, when I was trying to use a dynamite. I don't even know what I did. I just screwed up, I guess is the best way to put it. Like, I intended to, to buy a goon squad, and then I just never did. Your stock is being bought. Alright. No, I mean, those are still kind of working. Those aren't. Do that. We're not surprised. Nope. Just disappointed in me. That's fine. Man. Yeah, Terry's still just running away with it, and I'm down to a D stock rating, so I don't see any solution to this long term. Man, I'm D2. How did that happen? And well, because power's just so here. insane. It's yeah, just because power. Just, it's power's funny. the only thing you have to worry she about. He should have ruined himself with power. He, this, presumably, this is a game he won by stopped by not selling power. Yeah, I mean, it had to be, because he's just got so much of it down. He's got like 10 power flowing in a second. He's not, so he's not making any money off of it. But and I was trying to work to, around it, but surpluses weren't even fixing the fixing the problem long term. Yeah. Interesting. He's a strong player. Oh well, yeah. That is a little weird to take five so geotherms and still have it work. But... Yeah, he did an unconventional move, and you fixed it with another unconventional move. Here comes dead again. Yeah, I'm just gonna die to dead in a moment. And people spotting out my off-world, which oh, I think holograms need another pass at this point, based on what I'm seeing, but... You'll have to explain to me afterwards what happened. Yeah, that's fine. Not quite falling yet. Off-world Yeah. Launched. Look at all the money. Now this game is so beyond over. Yeah, no big you... surprise, though. I mean, expansives really should do well when there are no power surges and EMPs sure. available. Sure. Yeah. You gotta watch that black market. It's a... Thing to look at it yeah, so I keep trying, I guess. Well, that just broadcast everything to everybody, but that's fine, I suppose. It's not fine. It's not fine at all. I tried to do what I could about him, but it just was not quite enough. There's also just this awkward situation with carbon going on right now. Man, so, okay, I'm gonna observe Terry, what's he doing? At well, least currently selling power. Well, that's but weird, because power is staying so high. No, it's, it's dropping. Price well, dropping. yeah, but, I mean, it stayed so high for so long. Who knows when he started selling it again, though? Yeah, it's hard. I mean, all the buildings, my buildings disappeared, so that took a bunch of power consumption off the market. Um, yeah. World shipment launched. Yeah. All the money. Um, I don't know. Well, and I also finally managed to push into some reasonable number of solar panels, but it was just too little, too late by far. Yeah. Oh, well, you know what? If you look at the colony, it's mostly offices, which are heavy on power consumption. Yeah. Which, the colony can be a bit surprising in that way. It's it's frustrating. I would love a readout, in some yeah. way, of what the colony is doing. Right. Just tell me what the colony is doing, because I can't even... I don't know off the top of my head what all these buildings do, how much they do it, you know, all kinds of little details like that. Sure, yeah. No, I, I understand. Which... Yeah. And it'd be nice at the end of the game just to even show, like, how much they bought in each resource. Yeah. What the colony I I, was doing with the resources compared to everybody else. Yeah. yeah is, is Terry in chat? Probably. Usually is to some way, in some way. I'll have to ask him whether he was whether he was selling his power or not. Well, I guess we can look at the stats right now, see how he's how he did. Um, before the numbers get too ridiculous. Yeah, the auto sold four hundred and fifty thousand dollars of power. Yep. Power just stayed a lot higher than I was expecting it to. I'm just, I'm just surprised it it's went It's just, back it's so difficult. Well, there were a few patches ago, I don't know what happened, where power just started getting really awkward mm -hmm. to figure out, in particular. Like, okay. power just got weird. 
Yeah. So if you look at the graph, the power just completely drops. That was yeah. your surplus. Which was my with, surplus. With, with his geotherms. Yeah. And then it hits, it hits rock bottom. And then just sort, it sort of just slowly goes up. Curious if there was a hack in there. Whether Was he hacking power? Were there any power shortages? I'm going to take a look. I'm going back through the chat log. I see power surplus. There was my title, that was my infamous title auction. Uh, a couple power surpluses. Yeah, I did a couple power surplus, a few even maybe. I don't remember exactly oh, how many. I guess I, for a second. I did four Chase. power surpluses, is what I did, trying to knock that price down. Oh, wow. Well, that maybe, maybe that was the only thing that was keeping it down. Uh, well, it didn't even work very well, honestly. Like, the two at the start were fine yeah. getting it down, but I could not right. yeah, I thought keep that was, it I thought down that was at all. Great. It was just, man, you think with five Geothers. You know, it's funny, like, Geothers produce a lot, but they don't produce quite as much as you think they do. Mm -hmm. Because they don't have any adjacency, so... Man, I want to say Blue still has a shot, because he's actually halfway there right now. But really? I think the stock advantage is just going to be too much for him. Yeah. Like, he yeah, also he has 234000 in debt, and if he didn't have that, he'd be a lot, so much better off, but Terry's pushing to an off-world. I went into two off-worlds again that game. Maybe I couldn't quite afford that. I'm trying to remember the events and how everything right. played out, but... So I'd say the stock price looks about right here, would you say? Like yeah, no, the stock price looks colonies. That's about where it reasonable, be. given the fact that Terry has so many more colonies, in my opinion, but... And he also has no debt, which is a huge factor, right? Oh, that's going to be GG. Terry's just making way too much money, finally. I was kind of struggling that one for a while, this idea of... Yep. Okay, he did, okay, he did for a while, which is what shot it back up, and then it just never yeah. came back down after that. He pumped it up. Man, he also has... Look at how many claims he has down here with all this water and carbon. Sure. I, I love it. When, I love it when someone's able to take advantage of the, the not selling your power option because mm -hmm. it is kind of such a sideshow in a sense. It rarely gets used, but what it did here was it discouraged all of us from building power. Right? We're like, okay, forget about power. Let's right. just focus on other things. Things. So then he turned it off, and the price just kind of slowly went up, 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 up. And then once it got up too high, it was too late. You know, he could turn it back on and kill it. He gave me. When I got after the buyout, he made four hundred fifty thousand dollars on power. Yeah. So. Yeah, that was a huge part of his push overall, just making power work. And you'd think with five geotherms, that would be that would have been quite a risk. And in the mid game, he definitely suffered, but it just got to the point where I think you and I both died to power, trying to move out of it for too long. It was definitely a stall for him, though. Like, you could tell that he stalled out in the middle. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But we just bought too much power, I guess. And Blues was buying power, too. Like, all three of us were trying to take advantage of the fact that power had hit nothing. Mm -hmm. And then none of us could move back into it easily because steel and silicon and carbon were all insanely expensive yep. when it became necessary to move back into power. Yeah. I should have taken a third silicon tile that game. I could have. And I thought about it because it also gave me access to carbon, but... Yep. Oh well. It was an interesting little game, though. We've actually had a lot of interesting games this morning, in my opinion. Yeah, maybe good ones, I think. So, I mean, how do you feel about the, the new options and how they're working? No, I like the new mode. Where they need to be? Generally, because I do think... It's kind of awkward. Some of it goes... At least the destroy buyout feels better now. It feels better buying out people these days. You'll have to ask other people who are more experienced with the game than I am, because there are plenty of those at this point. But I mean, it's true. I just don't have time to play all the time these days. You know, sure, yeah. I play uh, on stream, I guess, and that's it. But honestly, yeah. I like the spot it's in. But we'll just have yeah. to to keep going. I was just yeah. thinking it's kind of awkward because some of it goes counterintuitive to some of the changes that were made. A little while back with like stock prices being inflated a bit i guess mm -hmm. because the whole point of that was to keep the games from getting too short yeah on the other hand i think the way it is with the majority buyout now you still have like that long extended game 
even if mm -hmm. two people fall out quickly, like say two people both get purchases quickly, right? Yeah. You can still have a long extended game because the stock prices still go very, very high for the remaining two players. Right. And they're gonna secure half their stock and move forward from there and so on and yeah. so forth. You know, it's just... Yeah. It could, it could lead to some good, good situations. And I'm hoping that it'll also combat the basic... Like, it's a perfectly valid technique, right? I would never get after somebody for debt diving, effectively. Mm -hmm. And then managing to barely hold on and then destroy everybody because mm -hmm. of the advantages they pulled while they were making no power, no life support, whatever. Right. But this seems to combat that a bit because it becomes a bit easier for that player to get knocked out. Like he has to play a little bit more cautiously and right. go ahead and make sure he's got his stock secured because yeah. you are not surviving if you have four of your <laughs> stocks secured. Yeah. Well, the way the stock works is it's sort of a secondary thing because, you know, you, you get the game bounce a certain way and then you decide, well, we'll, we'll have a stock start at $10 or $8 mm -hmm. and we'll have it go up at this rate. And like you do that based on how the rest of the game feels, right? Right, right. So I think this is like, you know, we need to play this for a while and then make up our, make up our minds about, you know, is, is the stock price starting too high? Is it starting too low? Is it growing too slowly? Right. Um, I was happy there with the, the jump in stock price after the buyouts. You yeah. You definitely tell, like, when you did You could buyout, feel you it when you got that good. buyout. I don't know if you've watched that game that I had on Tuesday where Yuzo got to 99% on me. Yeah, yeah. And that was, uh, that felt bad. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, that was a pretty... It's a pretty uh, fascinating game, but yeah. Yeah, but it felt bad from my perspective. <laughs> yeah, yeah, for sure. All right, well, I've probably got time for one more. Okay, uh, we can do one more. Right yeah, we can do one more. Uh, do you want to host it, or do you want me to host it this time? Uh, sure, I'll, I'll host it. Okay, sounds good. No, no, I don't want to. Well, I'll, I can just take my computer running. I mean, I'm going to have to run out at noon, but um, yeah. control. I'm sure I'll be bought out by then, so. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I'm just, it's important for me to play, but but I mean, I just I can't compete with the players of this level. This is how it goes. Well, uh, at least you can I, be comforted by the fact that that's the case for all developers. <laughs> well, it's all relative. I mean, I'm, I'm you know I'm quite good. You yeah. Know, in, the, in the office games, you know, I you know, I, I you know I clearly hold my own, but uh, it's a smaller pool. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right. Uh, unready. What did I do wrong? Rules? Rules look fine. Map will be fully revealed. Majority buyout. Reveal map, majority buyout, destroy buyout. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Last Whoa. game. Look at all that iron. That's a lot of research. Look at all that not aluminum. I don't know how to feel about this map. I kind of hate it, actually. The more I look at it, the more I hate it. I know what I want to do. Yeah, I know what you want to do, too. <laughs> actually. Let's get the Ow, jeez! I told you. There's another one. You're fine. Don't even don't even give me that. It's true. It's true actually. Oh, uh, someone found it right next to the high aluminum. That's a good move. Yeah, it was definitely a strong move. I mean, and that's entirely viable. They just have less less carbon. Someone went for the, the obvious for a less spot, yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna get the aluminum before he does. Mm. I do I did not. The thing is, I didn't want to found in that other crater. Yeah. And, uh, these new people. I don't know everybody's name yet. You know what? That's okay. We can just work with that. Okay. That's tempting. Kind of odd though. Hmm. I guess basically the question is, do I have enough of a lead to get away with this? Yeah. 
Prebaltic colony expanded. Yeah. Takes so long to get to the first black market purchase. <laughs> and it's so important in this game that I get it. Ah, oh, good. That feels better now that the more traditional black market items are back. Yeah. Well, I mean, Nuke, Dynamite, and Mutiny are all pretty, pretty hefty. I still like the idea potentially of trying to find a way to make it so the Seriously? We're gonna nuke my carbon this game? Wow. Why would you nuke my carbon this game? That's so rude. Oh, that wasn't my carbon. Yeah, and you have better Did carbon I than I do. I do. It didn't make any sense at all to nuke my carbon, actually. Looking at it, now I'm just mad because it was a stupid play. No matter who made it, except for, like, you. No, it was, it was just a stupid play. It was actually just a dumb play. Because anyone, I can just if rotate If anyone should have done it, it should have been me, actually, but I didn't do it. Yeah, I swear. And, well, and <laughs> you shouldn't have even nuked me if you nuked anybody, frankly. Yeah. Like, that wouldn't have made any sense whatsoever. It may not be the prettiest oh, thing man. Like, but Dom is it efficient. You should be proud of our guys. I will call that play out as just flat out dumb and bad. Mostly because we've got a lot of really strong players here, and they can handle it when I call them those things. Interesting and fight back. I was just expecting that. It's a fantastic wind turbine. Yeah, but it's making a lot of money. Well, not really, but it's at least doing something. Okay, now a nuke lands on you, finally, so we know who's doing it. For sure, probably. What happened? You got nuked. Oh, well that was... I didn't nuke myself. Details, yeah, exactly, right? <laughs> I just there are options here. All right, we're gonna do this one though. Now, and you could win a core sample to discover new resources. It's interesting. This one's so hard to value. Yeah, it is. It also partially comes down to how badly do you need that. Hmm. Okay, come on. I think you remember the course I have was don't use it until you have the tile. Mm -hmm. <laughs> or you have a claim available at any rate. I need to be real careful about how I approach this, unfortunately. I am turning food into glass. Did you say you're turning food into glass? Yep. Eat some glass. Oh, okay. I gotcha. Yeah, I decided to build, instead of building glass, I just built three farms. And the Whatever works. Just... Yeah, I mean, that's, that's a strong move. Especially because you got to three farms. Yeah, we're fine. Okay, that's good. I had to be so careful about how I did that, it was ridiculous, but we're good. Well, probably because carbon costs $68 right now. Just if I had to take a guess. Come on, work with me here, game. It's all good. Man, you upgraded with carbon that expensive. That's a play right there. Mm. Well, I'm doing fine at carbon. Carbon is not a problem. Oh no, carbon doesn't have to be a problem though. Okay, let's see. They're also doing fine on debt. All these mutinies everywhere. Terry going for like the same thing he did last time. I thought my aluminum would pay off better. I want to join the party. The mutiny party. All three of their mutinies. Some just screenshot. Yeah, there's a power surplus. 
Oh man, is that real? That's There's a hologram. beautiful. Was that was that you? Uh, there is no hologram for power. There's just no, a no, spy. No, hologram. No, no. Hmm. No power surplus. Did someone hack the power surplus? <laughs> was that you? Was no. that blues? No, it wasn't me. I didn't do anything of that sort. Well, then that's just the game. It's a good sense of humor. Yeah, I guess so. New land is available for auction. Bidding will begin at Well, that event was. Oh, whoa, blues! What did, did you just, just do, blues? What did you do? Oh, don't worry about it. It's not important. What? It's not important. It's all good. It's not a big deal. Terry says I'm out. Yeah, that's understandable. My, is he is he short is he short carbon? No, he did not. At least no, I don't think so. Like nobody has a hologram out, as far as I can tell. Oh yeah, you're no no. It's three thousand. Yeah, I someone know. Is a, someone is a hologram out. But so what are you saying? I don't understand. Don't worry about it. It's, <laughs> you can go watch the vod later. But, no, I mean, you can see the carbon short happening, right? Yeah, I can And see the then happening. blues expanded during it. Okay. Which ate up some, what, 300 carbon or so? Right. Instead of trying to, to make money off of that carbon in some fashion. There were, there were just ways to handle that. That would have been... Well, he's got to have his weight. Wow. Different. We've each, we've, each been, we've each been nuked our carbon. Yep. Is that... That's true. So is that, is that uh, Terry? You know, like, it might be at this point. He might have pulled a me. Trying to, like, I'm done with all, all of you. Just it get out like of my matter. game. You got three scavengers. Like the carbon market is not going to be that interesting. But well, it, it could be if it's going to get nuked all the time. I guess. Yeah. So much for power. I probably should put Goon Squad on my. Once I saw it coming, I should have Goon Squad up my carbon. Probably. <sighs> but isn't that just such a pain to, to have to do? Yep. Oh man, those are awful, and I'm not even paying attention to that fact. The like glass furnaces? No. I mean, yeah, your glass furnaces are awful too, but. I already moved out of mine, so we're good there. <laughs> <laughs> At least from my perspective. I can't even I can't even move or do almost anything. We're not surprised. Ah, shoot. Just disappointed in you. I had to go for it. What are you trying to hit? Oh take that. I tried to nuke a blues uh carbon tile. <laughs> We're gonna figure out what's going His on. His last one. These nukes after the game's over. Yeah, I'm wondering who started it. Yeah. I know who's trying is to it, end is it, it now. Is it one person, or is it. I love how none of us can upgrade, and so, like, well, Terry's just catching back up. Oh, wow. Blue's got to an expansion. That's interesting. He managed to push to it. We're not surprised. Yep, that's what I thought. Just disappointed in you. We caught a dirty rat trying to break uh, our stuff. Yep. Actually, you know what I should have done a long time ago? I just didn't want to make any transitions because carbon was so expensive, but I'm not thinking clearly right now. I'm too excited about nukes happening. Oh yeah, that's awful. I'm just not doing anything at this stage of the game. It's actually right. terrifyingly bad. I know the feeling. I have a claim somehow. I don't know when that happened or if I've just had this claim this whole time. No, all players receive a new claim. Never mind. At least it clarifies that. It's kind of important. Oh, beat some of that water. <laughs> oh, 
<laughs> well, I guess I deserve that. Oh. I don't even know what I'm going to do with this, though. If I could buy new claims, this would be a totally different game right now, but I can't. Not a problem. We'll have this done in a jiffy. I just and to locate Blues took my water that I wanted for adjacency, which is just awful for me. Yep, I deserved that too. The black market is online. I don't even know what to do with this game at this point. It's just too ridiculous. Terry's gonna run away with the whole thing while the rest of us just smack each other around for no reason. Probably awful, but just in case. I guess you never know. Well, I mean, it's, it's five thousand debt on kind of a a security blanket, I guess. I don't know. Depending on how you want to look at it, carbon's too expensive. I can't. I literally can't do anything. Everything's too ridiculous. Really, is that was that necessary? Was that actually necessary? Somehow I don't think so, personally. Alright, well we've all managed to secure some stock. Good for us. This game could go away. This game is dumb. That's what this game is. Nobody can make anything. Because <laughs> Carbon's too ridiculous. Actually, can I... Uh, kind of ish, I guess. Another option is to get real stupid with it. No, oh, it's finally just finally going down, huh? Finally, only took a year. It was just a matter of time. I was continuing considering goon squatting it, but then I saw the price just totally collapse. Yeah, that's you know that's fine. Just gonna do dumb things, I guess. The black market is online. Okay, where was? Jerry is showing his uh, his hacker ray. The hacker rails are is real. We're not surprised. Just disappointed in you. Mm-hmm. So is that off-world market? I just tried to dynamite. Where is it? On whatever tile of his says oh, defended. Oh, it looks like a, it looks like a uh, patent office. Sure, I guess. Yeah, it looks like a patent office. Oh, that's the wrong thing to do. The black market is online. Can I make a transition here? It's kind of awkward, but I guess I can. Finally. It's not gonna be great, but I guess it'll work. Carbon scrubbing! <laughs> oh, that's just. The game has got a sense of humor. Salt in the wound right there. That's all that is. This one. Who knows what you're going to It's ridiculous. It's just. It's very silly. I'm good it's a bad. very silly game right now. <laughs> Actually fits perfectly with what I'm in the process of doing. Now somebody else hit that off-world goon squad. I don't want to be the only one tearing through it, and it's not defended anymore. Oh well, there's that. Oh, oh, I hit. He's gonna buy a fifty thousand goon squad now if he wants it. Someone shorted carbon. Uh, or carbon shorted. I mean, either way. Yep. And there's that. All right. Well, he's just gonna sit there. Just gonna buy myself some Terry. Oh, 
Oh, this is a silly game. Blues is halfway to buying me. That's actually horrifying. I think I just spent too long messing about and didn't focus enough on getting upgraded. And now I'm dying to life support debt as usual. Oh, if he hadn't frozen my chem labs, right. I could buy him out. I'm so tempted to sell my own stock. Uh, Do it. Do it. Just man up and go for it. That's how you win games right there. Making the hard decisions. Ah, no! Got that share. Speaking of the hard decisions. Alright, I guess I need so to. So can, can I convince you to sell one share of dairy? Your stock is being bought. I don't have any shares in Terry. Blues has a share in Terry. Oh, it's Blues. Buy up Blues. Don't worry about me. I'm just in my corner doing my thing. Just sitting here, you know. Losing. Slowly but surely. Confidently. Getting my... Getting blown up literally all the time. It feels like. Yeah, not enough to do anything interesting yet, that's for sure. What do you want from me? I can't attack blues. <sighs> I kind of can. I kind of need to, actually. You enjoy that. You see now Terry's buying into blues too? I don't know what to do about that. This is such a colorful game. Yeah. Stock market is interesting. It takes a while to read it. Yeah, it does. <laughs> I have to actually pay attention and stuff. Get out of here, please. Okay, okay, okay. What can we do from here? So just keep going. I'm actually not as bad off as I thought I was. You're still in a, like a dominating position, as far as I can tell, but. Well, I can tell you what, carbon scrub me paid off. Uh, 16000 or whatever I spent for it. That yeah, was it's, it's making a difference right now. <laughs> I mean, I could have... It probably was worth 50000 Yeah, it's it's uh, it's paying off quite clearly. It's doing well. Doing work. Someone, wow, someone needing my engineering lab? That's interesting. Indeed. Mm. It's not go quite as well as I was hoping, but it should work okay. Okay. Our hackers have compromised the current service. Price manipulation begins shortly. Wow. These. But that's okay. What, just the chem price? Yeah. Yeah. Ah, come on. I lost out on it. Blues, I think, has had a spy on me the whole time. Which has been causing problems. Because I made a ridiculously... I made a gamble of a play. And Blues is the one who got the advantage off of it. I think he's had a spy down the whole time. I wish I could tell when I was being spied on. Something I really right. wish yeah, for. Spy, spy for the spy. Yeah. Just so I could know if something was going to go quite that horrifyingly wrong. It's an important detail sometimes. But uh, it, it just kind of comes into play this idea of you don't know and there's really no way to obtain information on other players' stockpiles in particular. Okay. It's very difficult to... Uh, combat them sometimes because of that. Wow, twenty thousand dollar spy. That's fascinating. Well spies are really important in this game, as it turns out. So this out. is so what's the call on the black market right uh, the off road market right now? Worth it or not? It's close I mean not for us at all, obviously. 
We can't, we can't afford to put one down. Even a little bit. I was really surprised Blues managed to crash that market that hard. Or maybe it was somebody else. It felt like Blues, though. I just lost so much money in my shorts, though. And I don't know why that happened. Because I was trying to keep track of things. Storing chemicals? I was producing a ton of chemicals. I know you were producing a ton of chemicals, too. But I was trying to keep track of exactly how much resources people were sitting on compared to... I had six chem labs, and they were all fully upgraded. Oh, they were all fully upgraded. I didn't yeah. see you were sitting on that many resources. Well, three, three or four. I'm fully upgraded. Gotcha. I had three chem labs that were fully upgraded. I didn't realize you'd gotten them that well upgraded in the time that I wasn't paying attention. I feel like I lost that. When that much is going up, it kind of feels like everyone lost loses out. Oh, come on. Oh, <laughs> that carbon price is crazy. It was at two dollars and now it's on a shortage. I just don't even know what to do with carbon. I'm gonna die to blues in a moment here, unfortunately. I've paid down all my debt, but he's still just sitting on too much money because I made the Kim play and it didn't work. And so I've been dead in the water ever since then. Unfortunately. And I really oh, don't man, feel a good I way to fight it back. Here. I mean, I guess I can do this. It's just, it's only delaying the inevitable at this point before Blues manages to purchase me. He's down in that D stock rating, but it's not enough. Oh, oh he yeah, bought he... you. Interesting. Yeah. I, I was, I like that guy control. I wasn't expecting... I should have cooked the books earlier. Oh, Terry just... bought you. And that changed Blue's <sighs> money situation somehow. I don't really know what happened there. Okay, so Terry bought you. I'm still nowhere near buying Blue's, and I'm still yeah. basically just I made a big mistake not cooking but... the books earlier in that game. Blue's should be cooking the books. That... It's just something I think about. Was me. Why did I do that? What in the world? I have no memory of queuing that up. Maybe I'm just crazy. I'm talking too much and losing track of what I'm doing, and it's losing me the game quite clearly. Because I think I'm just handing other people money with these shortages, because you have to pay so much attention when you try and use a shortage. Especially in a game with other scavengers. Oh man, how are those actually doing for me? Not very well yet. That's funny. I mean, you said an off-road market was not worth it, but I don't know. Like, this game... Well, I mean, for now, us, now we would have had to time our off-worlds very carefully. Now yeah. we could afford to move into an off-world, yes. But, uh, earlier, I do not think it was it was an option for us. Now, Terry's managed to pull back into it, just because we all were at each other's throats the entire right. time, as far as I can tell. Yeah, look at the carbon triangle. I'd love to know what was him to start taking a look at who bought. Who bought what those, black market? Those, those, those like especially nukes? those cheap nukes early. It's kind of an important detail. I bought zero underground. I bought one or I think I bought two. You bought two. Yeah, I bought two. What did you did you hit the carbon? I hit carbon at points. Yeah, Terry, enough, Terry that's hit, unfortunate. Terry bought three. I yeah, guess Terry he, started he, it. Three, he hit each one, each of us with it. And I tried to it's, capitalize on it, but it just totally wasn't fine. enough. That seems that seems like a good strategy. Yeah. All right. All right, I actually have to head off. But, All right, uh, get out of here. Blues will kill me soon. Yeah, keep streaming the rest of the game. I'll watch it later. All right. Yeah, well, yeah, obviously. And, uh, yeah, and let me know what you think. <sighs> kill me, Blues. Oh, you're taking forever about it. Maybe he's just going for Terry. <laughs> I mean, it's possible yeah. that he would want Maybe. to push for Terry and try and guarantee it. There it is. Finally, he takes me down. Well, we got a good... It's hard, hard to leave at this point. Him and that <laughs> D stock rating. It was close. I... If I just hadn't screwed up that Kim short. And Terry's got on three hundred thousand dollars, so Yeah, should Terry able. should have it easily at this point. Blue's debt is just too insane. Terry has an off world market established. He's been he on more territory oh, longer. Blue should be cooking the books. It's only three thousand dollars. He would save himself like fifty thousand. <laughs> yeah, he'd save himself a lot of debt with Cook the Books, that's for People sure. Just forget about it. But I think all of us just got at each other too much, destroyed carbon, none of us could keep up with Terry's upgrades. And people stopped attacking his off-world for some reason. Yeah. Yeah, that was a that was a problem. That was definitely a problem. Cool. All right. Well, thanks for thanks for playing. And, mm -hmm. uh, I will. Oh, well, I'm the host, right? I, was uh, I guess you are the host. Yeah. So you just stay in here, and we'll be good. Right, ah, cool. Blues found the off-world finally. <laughs> All right. Catch you later. The black yep. market is Alright guys, well, Terry's got this pretty easily, there it is. That's gonna be GG. No big surprise there after all the rest of us kind of...
tore each other apart, and Terry's just been sitting on that offworld the whole time. If Terry's offworld had been attacked a little bit more frequently, maybe that would have gone differently. I guess mutinies were up to 50,000. Dynamite was at 30. Pretty heavy black market use that game, actually. I'm just wondering if I hadn't screwed up those shortages quite so badly, what would have happened with me? Might have been able to still bring Terry down long term, but it was a bit of an awkward game there. Trying to figure it all out. But yeah, there you go, guys. A few interesting, interesting games of Offworld, that's for sure. Certainly a lot more interesting than a lot of the others. Yeah, I did not make a whole lot on Kim's that game. Not near as much as I should have. I made a lot on Carbon. So some of those nukes kind of panned out. And then Blues made a ridiculous amount on Kim's as well. They both just killed me in that shortage. That's what I get. Terry also got, yeah, 20 off-world launches off for Terry. It's pretty solid. It was good work by him sitting in the corner, pretending to be dead for a real long time, and then coming out to win the game. You gotta hand him that. He also managed to make quite a bit on water and food. Didn't make a whole lot on world. It was entirely that off world market. If people had shut that down a little bit better, I don't think there's any way Terry manages to pull back into that game. But since he was able to sit on it, or maybe he even had two of them for 20 launches, that'll make the difference pretty easily. All right, guys. That was the Mohawk stream. Um, quick update for those of you who are sticking around till this point. I am going to not be here on Saturday. So I will not be streaming on Saturday because I will be out of town, unfortunately. And so that means the next off-world stream for me will be on Tuesday on my channel, twitch.tv slash Zoltar327. You all know it by now. It's not a big deal. And if you guys want to stream on Summit Saturday, somebody else has to do it because I will be out canoeing or something. I'm not even sure. It's with my wife's family. That's just the way it works. But so until Tuesday, thank you everyone for watching. And I'll see you next time.